Ay, ay, ay. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, ay, ay. You know all my struggles. You know what? All right, Cal. So, champion. How was it to get that championship, man? It was awesome. I mean, uh, we've come close, you know, the past couple years prior mm -hmm. to that. Um, weren't able to get it done, but, you know, being able to get back to that same position was, you know, awesome in itself, but to be able to actually finish it off and win it uh, last year was pretty special. Man, you had an adventurous all season, man. Not only did you get that championship, then you go do the WBC. Mm -hmm. And, man, you know, I was just talking to players throughout that that were involved in it. It was a historic moment, I think, for baseball, but for you, how was it for you to be out there with, you know, guys like Trout, you know, just different guys on the team? Yeah, USA uh, WBC stuff was awesome. I mean, I've watched the guys on TV and, you know, on you know, opposing sides, but I've never been in the same clubhouse or, you know, been in the same dugout with them. So being able to personally connect with, with a lot of the players and, you know, there's a lot of MVPs, you know, Silver Sluggers, Gold Glovers on the team. And, uh, just being in the same clubhouse and being able to connect with them on a personal level is pretty cool. I love it. I love it, man. As a baseball fan, seeing Trout versus Otani, mm -hmm. and I think that was the moment that everybody just walked away with like, whoa, how was that, man? Because, I mean, everybody was on, like, eggshells and like, man, what's going to yeah. happen here? It was pretty weird how that worked out where that was, like, the last matchup of yeah. the whole thing. But, a written baseball game. Yeah, movie. I know, right? Uh, but it, it was pretty cool to watch. I mean, you know, our whole lineup was pretty fun to watch, um, you know, the whole way through the – Mexico game over in AZ was pretty pretty uh, crowded, loud, and pretty awesome. The Venezuela game, and then uh, you know that last game against Japan was pretty cool. I wish we you know ended up getting a couple extra runs right there, but uh, I mean they they played a phenomenal game, and you know had a phenomenal job uh, in time staying with the team and you know being able to be in the same dugout and clubhouse with everyone. I love it. This 2023 Astros team, man. I feel like. You know, obviously, there's just different injuries. Guys are not healthy, mm -hmm. and you're going to get the guys eventually. But I feel like this is something that happened last year, and then the team got hot. For you, the 2023 team, what do you see about this team that says, hey, we can repeat? Yeah, we're, I mean, we it's roughly the same group. Uh, I mean, we got a couple guys hurt right now, which obviously no team wants to have, have people hurt. But, I mean, it's just kind of how it is right now. But we just got to keep playing our game and try to win as many as possible. And, you know, those guys will come along at some point throughout the, throughout the season later on. But... We just gotta, you know, try and come out here and win every single game until then. When we come back, uh, they'll, they'll be able to help in whatever way they can. All right, cool. Two more questions. I'm looking down at your feet. I see you wearing the Luca ones, man. Yeah. So it's very weird to see different guys you know, wearing the basketball shoes on the field. Yeah. But you like to train those. What do you think about them? Yeah, I like them. They're comfy. Uh, I mean, they match pretty well with the white uh, and orange for our, you know, color. So uh, that was another big reason of getting them. But I mean, these are the only pair of Lucas I got. I figure I might as well get them since they match too. But they're, they're pretty comfortable. I got. Like, Try and get a you know a couple different pairs and stuff. Okay, hey, cool, cool. Last question. So, I know we did that baseball Mount Rushmore question last mm -hmm. year, right? Where well, you did the positions, but yeah. just four for the outfield. If you did your four that you put on the mountaintop, who are the four outfields you put on the Mount Rushmore? Uh, like players right now or all, all time? All time. You can mix in there. Yeah, either one. Uh, I'm probably putting Griffey, Trout, and uh, Barry Bonds. Okay. All right, we need one more. Oh, fourth. Um. That's a good three. I'd, I'd, I'd probably put Mookie out there. Wow, I like that. I like that. I like that. Well, you know, Cal, man, I'm happy for you, man. Congratulations on that championship, man. We'll be talking again soon, yeah. brother. Thank appreciate you. you. Appreciate, appreciate you. you. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, ay, ay.